Streaming live now on News8000.com. You're watching WKBT Lacrosse. This is News 8 Now at noon. Good afternoon, everyone, and thanks for watching News 8 Now. I'm Ken Kozarowski. Police are searching for a motive after a gunman opened fire at a Walmart in Chesapeake, Virginia, killing six people and wounding four others. Authorities say the shooter, who was an employee of the store, apparently killed himself and was dead when police found him. Skylar Henry has the latest from Chesapeake. Police are combing through the scene of the latest mass shooting in the country, this time at a Walmart in Chesapeake, Virginia. There's people on the ground right now. They've, they've already taken a person or two out. Police say a store employee opened fire last night, killing six people and wounding several others. Witnesses say fellow workers were among the victims. He killed a couple of uh, people. I, by the grace of God, I made it, and all the other people I knew made it. Literally just walked out the place he shot up. Police say the gunman apparently killed himself and was dead when they arrived. We have reason to believe that there's no risk to the public at this time. The shooting happened with less than an hour to go until closing, and the store was busy with Thanksgiving shoppers and workers stocking up for Black Friday. He actually was shot in his side. This woman said her brother was among the wounded. What was really strange to us is that he clocks in at 10, so he hadn't even been there 10 minutes. Virginia's governor noted it's the second mass shooting in the state in recent weeks. Earlier this month, a gunman killed three people at the University of Virginia. That absolutely uh, brings with it a sense of anger, a sense of fear, uh, a sense of deep, deep grief. Walmart tweeted that it was shocked at this tragic event. Skyler Henry, CBS News, Chesapeake, Virginia. And according to the Gun Violence Archive, there have been at least 36 mass shootings this year where four or more people have been killed. President Biden says he will extend the pause on student loan repayment again. The announcement follows a barrage of lawsuits aimed at stopping the Biden administration's student loan cancellation program, as well as after a federal judge in Texas blocked the plan, calling it unlawful. The president's plan would cancel billions of dollars in federal student loans. The White House says millions of applications have already been approved. But I'm completely confident my plan is legal. But right now it's on hold because of these lawsuits. We're not going to back down, though, in our fight to give families breathing room. That's why the Department of Justice is asking the Supreme Court of the United States to rule on the case. But it isn't According to the White House, payments will restart 60 days after the Supreme Court makes its decision or on June 30th, whichever of those comes first. For that reason, the Secretary of Education is well, it's shaping out to be an absolute beautiful day across the Cooley region today. Let's start off with La Crosse County as high temperatures will mainly be into the 40s today. We'll be uh, just shy of 50 if you're in Bangor, 47 and lots of sunshine in Mill Ridge. A little bit uh, closer towards the low 40s though if you're in La Crosse and Alaska. We'll see a combination though of the 40s and 50s, especially down south. Will highs reach around 51 today in Gays Mills, 52 in Steuben. We'll be looking at 45 in Arcadia today and 47 in Sparta, 45 in Warrens. 45 in Melrose, 44 in Black River Falls, and 44 today if you're in Blair with plenty of sunshine to go around. A mix of clouds and sun across our north zones with temperatures mainly into the low 40s. It'll be 43 in Eau Claire. Let's get checked down your afternoon and night planner. We'll start off here through the remainder of the afternoon. Lots of sunshine. Temperatures into the upper 30s to low 40s. Now we start to see some increasing clouds move in around 5 p.m. with temperature around 40, and then we drop into the 30 starting by 7, and that's when our skies will really start to take over as far as the mostly cloudy side of things will go here and that will pretty much persist throughout the rest of the night here coming up but stay tuned we'll have a check on the four other forecast that's coming up in just a bit ken back right. to you thanks derek well a new estimate puts the cost of a freight rail strike at one billion dollars in its first week the anderson economic group is calling the potential strike one of the most disruptive events that can happen to the economy lost agricultural goods and food spoilage would quickly add to mounting losses the Retail Industry Leaders Association is calling on policymakers to intervene to avoid a, quote, economic disaster. The four rail unions who voted against an agreement with U.S. freight railroads set a joint strike date of December 9th if no contract deal is reached. Wisconsin lawmakers are debating how to spend the state's projected $6.6 .6 billion surplus. 
Republicans want to make what they call transformational tax law changes. Assembly Speaker Robin Voss and Senate Majority Leader Devin Lemahue say they want to get rid of a tax paid by businesses and lower income taxes for the wealthiest filers. Governor Tony Evers has rejected those ideas in the past, and Republicans don't have enough votes to override a governor's veto. After a 32-year career, Wisconsin State Senator Alberta Darling announced she's stepping down as of December 1st. Darling joined the legislature in 1992 and has represented a conservative district featuring several affluent suburbs north of Milwaukee. Now, in her time at the Capitol, she wrote over 200 bills that were signed into law. With Darling heading out, Republicans are now one seat short of a supermajority in the Senate. A special election will be held to fill her seat. Now, Governor Evers today thanked Darling for her service, tweeting Senator Darling has earned the respect of colleagues on both sides of the aisle because she's a diligent leader who's always car carried herself with poise, class, and grace. I've always appreciated her thoughtfulness in our conversations over the years. A friendly reminder, the Salvation Army of La Crosse is still accepting gifts for the Angel Giving Tree program. You can choose a tag from a tree at the Onalaska and La Crosse Walmarts, Pizza Ranch, and Advanced Auto on Losey Boulevard. Then you shop for the child on the tag. Then you have until November 30th to get gifts, put them in a gift bag, and return the presents and tag to the Salvation Army. If you'd like to volunteer to hand out gifts or prepare some food boxes, you can sign up on the Salvation Army's website. And the Salvation Army is also recruiting more bell ringers to tend to their famous red kettles. The campaign is incredibly important to the group. The donations you make over the holiday season support Salvation Army programs year-round. To sign up to ring, go to registertoring.org. When we come back, keeping you and your family safe during Turkey Day. Health experts are sharing their tips for preparing a safe and delicious dinner. Hurry, get incredible Black Friday doorbuster deals at Slumberland Furniture during our Thanksgiving sale. Get low, low prices on our amazing doorbuster deals starting Friday, like this modern sofa chaise for just $3.98 while they last. And they won't last long, so hurry. And get 30% off our already low prices on everything else. Plus, we're still offering no interest for three years. Incredible Black Friday doorbusters starting Friday while they last at Slumberland Furniture. It's not too early for Carpets to Go to talk about a holiday flooring sale because you'll want that flooring in and ready to impress for holiday entertaining. Click Together Luxury Vinyl Plank starts at just $3.25 a square foot. Snap Together Luxury Vinyl Tiles starting at $5.25 a square foot. Your carpet remnant purchase comes with a free six pound pad. Ask about six months interest free financing with approved credit. Get your home ready for the holidays with a little help from Carpets to Go during the holiday sale going on now in Onalaska. Most CBD stores' journey begins in front of a computer, but here at Fifth World, our journey begins on the farm. We grow all the hemp for our CBD and other products, but whether on the farm... ...or in our certified kitchen where all our products are made to the highest standards, or at the shop where we offer therapeutic massage, we guarantee that quality comes first. Come sign up for our 10-day trial sample or bring in a receipt from any local competitor and we'll beat their price. So stop by today and remember, here at Fifth World, we're all family. Reserve your tickets, dust off your evening gown, and ring in the new year at the Vark Foundation's New Year's Eve Gala at the Cargill Room. You'll enjoy formal dining, dancing, unique auction items, and plenty of champagne. Get your tickets early for La Crosse's most exclusive New Year's Eve celebration. This year's proceeds benefit kids with disabilities in the La Crosse and surrounding communities. For more information or to order your tickets, go to varkinc.com backslash gala. Attend for the spectacle, stay for the cause. Order your tickets today. And he was a kid, four years old, he had lats. The only way you get lats is from doing prison time and doing pull-ups. He was a bad little kid. He was so evil, his first baby tooth, it came in chipped. Walking around the neighborhood smoking his mama's cigarettes. Get ready for the comedy of Marlon Wayans, the Microphone Fiend Tour. Saturday, February 11th at Ho-Chunk Gaming, Black River Falls, Wisconsin, with special guest D.C. Irvin. Tickets on sale now at Ticketmaster. Don't miss Marlon Wayans live. Thank you for watching News 8 Now. Expect more. Kids and their families gathered at both the Boys and Girls Club of Greater La Crosse on Tuesday night to celebrate Thanksgiving. The clubs had enough food to feed more than 100 people. The Boys and Girls Club paired up with Hope Restores for the feast. And along with the turkey and stuffing, families enjoyed mac and cheese, sweet potatoes, and collard greens. For the clubs, it's a way to connect with the families that they serve. 
They get to see our, our staff in a different light. Our kids have to get to have more fun. Um, and we just get more of that relationship building with parents and not just the kids as well. So it's a big uh, event for us to really serve food for anybody who may need it, but also just connect and bond with the families that we serve at the Boys and Girls Club on a daily basis. And the event also included activities for families plus a raffle. If you're in charge of making the Thanksgiving meal this year, there are a few things to keep in mind to make sure everyone stays healthy. Experts at Gunnison Health System say food safety begins with the preparation of the food. Try to avoid storing raw meat next to other foods that don't require cooking first, like veggie and fruit trays. When cooking meats, make sure they meet the proper internal temperature. Red meats should be cooked to at least 145 degrees. Ground meats and poultry, like a Thanksgiving turkey, should be cooked to 160 degrees. When you're serving the meal, make sure it doesn't stay out too long. Something to think about is a temperature danger zone, which is 40 degrees Fahrenheit to 140 degrees Fahrenheit. You don't want foods in that temperature range for more than two hours at a time before getting it cooled in the refrigerator or freezer. Experts say you can safely store leftovers in the fridge for three to four days and then in the freezer for three to four months. And in more Thanksgiving safety news, if you plan to fry your bird this year, there are some definite safety rules to follow. This is video of firefighters in Texas showing us what can happen if you have too much oil in the fryer or if you put a frozen turkey into hot oil. Now, it's not just the turkey to worry about. If you splash water in a pan with hot oil, that can go up in flames, too. Firefighters recommend taking extra precautions. Uh, you don't want to have the fryer too close to a structure. If anything happens, it's going to easily become a structure fire. Uh, you want the oil and the water to never, ever mix. So if it does catch fire, uh, don't use water or a uh, hose to put it out. Um, and never uh, keep the cooking stuff unattended. If a fire does happen, put some baking soda on it or smother the flames with a lid. Now, if a bigger fire happens, that's when you call 911. Final pep preparations are underway in New York City for the Thanksgiving Day Parade. The iconic balloons that soar above the route will be blown up tonight near Central Park. The popular children's character Bluey makes her debut, while Greg from Diary of a Wimpy Kid gets an updated balloon, and Baby Shark gets a first-of-its-kind balloon and float combo. As we head to break, here's a live look at the New York Stock Exchange. Stay with us, though. We've got medical news coming up next. Now, here's your two-minute take on area businesses, communities, events, and entertainment. Welcome to Two Minute Take. I'm Tori Kale Scholes. Today, we're going to take two minutes to talk to Stephanie Pipkin. She's the owner and CEO of a company that is going to change your life. Stephanie, let's talk about Serene Clean. You bet. So Serene Clean was opened in April of 2019. It was just supposed to be a side hustle with me, and it has now blossomed in the past three and a half years to a team of about 30. We service about 200 appointments a week, both residential and commercial, and we service uh, the surrounding areas of Sparta, Black River Falls, and Alaska. Why should anybody, a homeowner, a business owner, consider outsourcing their cleaning? I think a lot of people feel shame and pressure to maintain this beautiful home on top of all of the other stresses in their lives. You know, having a job, kids, pets, trying to maintain a social life and a, a healthy life, and something's got to give. And I think looking at outsourcing something like cleaning, maybe something you don't enjoy as much so you can focus on what you do enjoy in your life, I, there should be no shame in that, and I think it's actually really wise. And I think when you're talking about a cleaning service coming into a person's house, there's a lot of trust that goes into that. What can a person expect from Serene Clean and the fact of trust when they come into your house? Absolutely. It can be very nerve-wracking having somebody in your home, especially if you've never had that before. Uh, Serene Clean, the big focus is on professionalism, communication, and having people on our team that really get it. So all of our team members are incredibly empathetic. Most of them are moms themselves, and they can really just connect to why we're doing what we're doing and just utmost discreetness. And just overall, you're going to have such a professional experience. You shouldn't have to stress more that the cleaning lady is coming. It should be something that takes the stress off of you. You can find out more information on the website. They've got a Facebook page. All the information is on the lower side of your screen. For more Two Minute Takes, go to news8000.com. What you eat can help keep your memory sharp. Plus, there are benefits of earlier screening for diabetes. Michael George has a look at some of the day's top health stories. 
new study in the UK finds screening adults beginning at age 40 for diabetes could detect undiagnosed type 2 cases at least two years earlier. Researchers say the increased screening would allow those in need to get treatment at a much earlier stage in their condition and reduce the risk of complications. People who had COVID-19 can still benefit from getting the vaccine. Researchers in Denmark found the vaccine delivered protection over and above natural immunity during all three waves of variants and offered 60 to 94 percent protection from reinfection, depending on the variant. Eating foods that contain antioxidant flavanols may help maintain brain health. Research published in the online version of Neurology suggests foods like kale, beans, tea, and even wine contain plant-based chemicals that can slow memory decline. That's a look at some of the day's top health stories. Michael George, CBS News, New York. All right, let's take a live look outside through City Cam 8. Derek Sibley going to be in next with our forecast. Our locally owned Carpet One has a huge selection of floors. Uh-huh, at prices just as good as those big box stores. But you don't need a talking dog to tell you that. Well, at least big box stores are good for something. Toyotathon is on. It's the most magical time of the year with great deals on Camry, RAV4, and Tundra. Where's the Tundra? Fields borrowed it. What? Keep them coming! Every new Toyota comes with Toyota Care, a two year or 25,000 mile maintenance plan and roadside assistance. See your local Toyota dealer or visit Toyota.com to learn more. Tis the season for Toyotathon. Toyota, let's go places. Change it up and choose Dutch Boy for Menards. Get the best quality Dutch Boy paints at the best prices. Pick out the perfect color. We offer free custom color matching and tinting to create thousands of color options. And with Dutch Boy's easy opening, smooth pouring container, and no prep, no prime formula, transforming your home has never been easier. Save 11% on all Dutch Boy paints. Now, during Menards' last 11% off in 2022. Save big money at Menards. I've practiced personal injury law for four years. For 20 years. For 32 years. But I won't write your will. I don't write contracts. And I don't handle divorces. The law profession is broad and complex. I focus my career on one thing. Helping injured people. All I do every day. Is help injured people get the compensation that they deserve. But by Goff and Rody, that's how we get results. Great deal on stain resistant floors. Go to Carpet One. Here to floor you. Carpet One Floor and Home. Save big and get special financing. The Board Store Home Improvements is thankful for over 12,000 customers. As a veteran owned local business, we appreciate your business the past 33 years. We would love to thank you. Stop in and say hi. Lots of sunshine here today all across the Cooley region, but let's start first with La Crosse County. Going to be into the upper 40, especially if you're in the Bangor Middle Ridge area today between 47 to 49 degrees. Same story here in, in Mindoro at 47, West Salem at 48, but notice how the further west you go, it's a little cooler with high temperatures in the low 40s today in La Crosse and on Alaska. 50 in Soldiers Grove this afternoon, looking sunny here in Verroque with a high of 47 degrees for you. Gaze Mills at 51 degrees and Lafarge at 50, looking at highs reaching 49 this afternoon if you're in Stoddard and the same story can be said in Brownsville as well. 44 and sunny here today in Winona, 45 in Melrose, looking at highs reaching 47 in Sparta and 45 in Warrens, 44 for Black River Falls and uh, conditions in Arcadia today looking quite sunny. Temperatures for you at 44, 42 though if you're in Osseo to the north and highs reaching those low 40s across our north zones with plenty of sunshine to, to go around here today. Let's get a check on your day cast. We're going to start off uh, the afternoon at 1 o'clock with temperatures at 39 and plenty of sun, 42 degrees and sunny by 3, partly cloudy at 40 degrees by 5, and then we start to see some increasing clouds begin to roll in as we head into the evening hours. High temperatures today rising into those uh, mid-40s mostly, but low 50s can be said further south in Basquebel and areas like Prairie du Chien. Let's break down your Turkey Day forecast for tomorrow on Thanksgiving Day. Starting off mostly cloudy, temperatures around 34. There is a slight chance of a drizzle for the rest of the day. If you don't see a drizzle, we're just looking at mainly overcast skies with temperatures mainly into the 30s and 40s throughout the day. 
So that south wind here is going to help us out along with that sunshine to keep us uh, mainly quiet, dry and overall warm and sunny here today before we start to see a cold front back to the west move in. That's going to help increase the cloud cover as well here for us. That front's going to move in by tomorrow and uh, we will continue to look at moisture from the system associated with the trough of low pressure along with the cloudy skies throughout the day tomorrow and that slight chance of a drizzle again here possible. As we head into Thursday night into early Friday, conditions will continue to remain cloudy before we start to see some increasing sunshine as we head into Friday morning and then really just continue throughout the rest of the day on Friday as well. Lots of sun, clear weather and only a couple of uh, patchy areas of uh, uh, cloud cover, but overall that's about it. Here's a check on your eight-day forecast and we'll be looking at highs mainly into the 40s as we head into Friday. Mostly sunny skies. It's going to be quite mild though on Saturday with a high of 47 degrees, but hey, we'll take that. 40 degrees on Sunday turning mostly cloudy. And the mostly cloudy skies will continue, it looks like, as we head into early next week on Monday with highs around 43. Now, there is a chance that we could be looking at a couple of showers here on Tuesday and Wednesday with highs into the low 40s. And our low temperatures are, will mainly be into the 20s and 30s. Don't forget, you can also download the First Alert Weather app for free on the Google Play or the App Store. You get all those current weather conditions as well as the weather alerts, if any, go into effect. And, of course, you do get your eight-day forecast. Back to you, Ken. Thanks, Derek. Still to come, a gesture reaching thousands of miles. A Kendall woodworker sending some Christmas magic to Four Ukrainian kids. Uh, one, eight, Come in and be inspired. Find the perfect gift or treasure for your home. Curated offers a large variety of carefully selected items in all price ranges. Curated, the La Crosse area's full-service interior design studio and retail boutique. 320 Pearl Street, La Crosse. Improving your home? Gift cards, free installation, half off, save 20%? No. More choices, lower prices? Yes. The board store is locally owned and has been serving homeowners over 30 years from our La Crosse showroom. We don't believe in bribes and baloney. You get the same fair prices any day and every day. Windows and doors, bathrooms and kitchens, sunrooms and siding. Designed to installation, a team of over 70 to complete your project on time and on budget. The Board Store, 524 Copeland Avenue, La Crosse. Care, it's baked into everything we do. Like Perkins Bacon Fest. Made with care and lots of bacon. Starting at just $8.99, enjoy all our delicious favorites from pancakes to cheeseburgers and more. And don't forget, nothing sweetens the season like a fresh baked pie from Perkins Holiday Bake Shop. Save time and order online at PerkinsToGo.com. Take your wand. That's not a wand, it's a stick. It will be a wand once you learn your magic. American Home, Fireplace and Patio here. Who doesn't eat every day? Why not let us make your meals all special? Great gas, perfect pellet, and charming charcoal komodos are in stock waiting for you. Where's your wand? Right here. It used to be a stick. What happened? It grew. Come in and be inspired. Find the perfect gift or treasure for your home. Curated offers a large variety of carefully selected items in all price ranges. Curated, the La Crosse area's full-service interior design studio and retail boutique. 320 Pearl Street, La Crosse. Thank you for watching News 8 Now. Expect more. A Kendall man is one step closer to making Christmas better for children from Ukraine. News A now first introduced you to Kale Kavistad earlier this year. The woodworker made 200 trucks for Ukrainian children who were forced to flee their homes because of Russia's invasion. At a recent doctor's appointment, Kale was telling his doctor what he was up to, and she was so inspired she asked her co-workers to help. So they are now donating 200 activity books to pair with <laughs> Kale's work. We sent out an email to all the employees at Mayo and the Onalaska campus here, and they responded quite generously. This way they got something else to do besides just play with trucks. They can do coloring and learn things in them books. There's a lot of different stuff in those books. With the help of another community member and donations from the public, Kale says they're donating trucks, books, and some crayons that will be shipped to Poland and into the hands of young Ukrainian refugees just in time for Christmas. We'll be right back to wrap things up. That I can't 
flavor. You've waited all year for Black Friday Door Busters. Bring home a Tempur-Pedic mattress for only $56 per month. On Black Friday, the first 100 guests get four months free of Sirius XM streaming. And Mattress Gallery visitors can enter for a chance to win a free Tempur-Pedic mattress. Ashley. The Dine Dash and Fly program is back. Brought to you by the La Crosse Regional Airport. And Dream Vacations Travel. Grab a passport at any of the participating restaurants, at the airport, or online. Entry is free, no purchase necessary. Collect stamps when you dine at each restaurant. Get five stamps for a free t-shirt. You could win LSE swag, gift cards, and even flight vouchers. For more information, go to lseairport.com or bestvaluetrips.com. And remember, you have until December 31st to enter. We cannot wait any longer. We need new appliances. The last 11% off sale is going on now. Save big money on your next project at Menards. So, yeah, we need to add another bathroom this year. The last 11% off sale is going on now. Save big money on your next project at Menards. Toyota Thon is on. Now's the time to get an exciting new Toyota. Like Camry Hybrid, RAV4, Tundra, and more. Uh, how did you... Magic. Right now, during Toyotathon, get 3.49% APR for 48 months on a new Toyota Corolla, Camry, RAV4, Highlander, or Tacoma. Come in today. Toyota, let's go places. I love this mattress. Mm-hmm. So, can I ring you up? We'll take it. Ashley's Black Friday mattress sale is going on now. This week, get an additional 10% off Ashley Sleep Doorbusters. Plus, save $1,000 on select Sealy mattresses at Ashley. Download the News 8000 First Alert weather app from your app store today. 42 degrees and mostly sunny for the remainder of the day and a slight chance of drizzle here for tomorrow. Otherwise, cloudy skies with a high of 46 degrees. A mix of clouds and sun throughout the rest of the week with highs into the 40s and low temperatures in the 20s and 30s. We'll watch out for a slight chance of rain early to mid next week. All right, not too shabby. Thanks, Derek. And thank you all so much for joining us for News 8 Now at noon. We appreciate your time. If you're traveling for the holiday, please do it safely and securely. And everyone have a very happy Thanksgiving. We'll see you.